All right, welcome back to the channel. So what we're gonna be doing is testing out the latest model of Claude, Claude 3.7 Sonnet on exactly processes that I have used and ranked some of my content for, which is to use one of the projects that I've created in Claude and we're allowed to, or we're able to take our YouTube video transcript and then we're able to uh, advanced prompts and so forth, what you're seeing right here to create a really good article that looks and sounds like a human wrote the article, but it's based on factual information from your actual YouTube video. So I'm gonna show you how it all works and so forth. So we're gonna go and take a look at my latest video, uh, Crank Review, and we're gonna go and try to create an engaging article using the latest model of Claude. And then we're going to go and I'll actually uh, create a blog post on my website and see if we can actually get this ranking. And then what we'll do is I'll come back after it processes and so forth and indexes, then we'll come back and we'll actually start trying to see if we can get a click rank tool that is currently available on AppSumo. I'll leave the link below and to see if we can do some things to further optimize it, okay? Now, I've already looked at some of the stuff that I did yesterday with the Ranklytics review. We actually, not the Ranklytics review, the click rank review, I actually optimized, I used ClickRank to optimize some things on my on-page technical SEO for Ranklytics review. It was ranked like 23 or something like that, or I think it was ranked number 19, so just barely on page two, and it's moved further up the page overnight to, uh, I believe it's ranked currently ranked number 13. So it moved up like six spots overnight that undoubtedly would have been because of the, the stuff that we did in ClickRank. So really cool, I'll make more content on that, and that's the difference between what I do is I'm actually testing these tools out to see if we actually get results and get you know can get some better rankings and so forth. See if these tools actually work and if they're worth your time and effort and investment. Okay, if you want to learn more about how. I actually use Claude on a daily basis in my business to write emails and to write blog posts and to you know basically use, you can see right over here, I use this all day long. I use it for multiple YouTube channels. I use this, this is my go-to tool. And so if you wanna learn how I put all this together and all some very, very unique ways to use, then there'll also be a link below. You can go check out a couple of my courses, but it's called the AI Alchemist. All you do is just click on the link below. You'll go over here and you'll click on more details and it will take you over here where you can learn more about the AI Alchemist and how you, what you actually learn and so forth. So really, really cool stuff right there. So let's get started. We're gonna go and grab our transcript. I've already done that ahead of time. So I'm gonna go over here and I'm just gonna go grab this transcript right here. I'm going to copy that. And then what we'll do is we'll be able to go into Claude. Now I already have all this prompting and so forth and come in and see it's, it's a very advanced prompt right over here. It's telling it exactly what I want it to do. And you'll see, I've just updated this because one of the reasons why I wanted to create this video was to see how well this will, will perform from a content length standpoint. Because the last time that I tried to write an article, we actually, I was blown away that Claude was actually writing like 1400, 1500 word articles. And before that, it would always struggle to hit 800 words. It could just never write in one go an 800 word article. And so I've updated this to 1400 words right here inside of this advanced prompt right over here. And then you can see that we're always telling it to reflect and use the information right over here. I say, don't use any words on the AI words and phrases band lift list right over here. If you wanna get access to this AI words bands list, there'll be a link below, go and sign up to the LearnWire newsletter, which I'm going to be uh, releasing our first news newsletter very, very soon. And so go and sign up to the LearnWire newsletter. And that's where I'm gonna do recaps of all the videos that I'm creating, all the latest software that I've looked at and tell you which ones I think are the best and so forth. It's only gonna be once or twice a month. So you're not gonna get emails all the time. It'll, they'll just be really nice recap emails, okay? And it, it just has all this information right over here, right? And so what we're gonna do is all I have to do, I've set this up and you can see how many times I've used this. Look at this. I've used this a ton. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to left click in the box and I'm going to do a control V and then we get that nice clipboard that no other software really does. I love how they just clipboard this in there. It's just a very, very clean way to use this. So now that we've pasted in the YouTube transcript, now all I'm going to do is just push go. Now it's going to go out there and it's going to start processing based on the prompt that we've put in and the instructions and based on the YouTube transcript that we went over here. This is my YouTube transcript. I'm going to be clear 
clear in all my videos that this is actually my YouTube video and I'm getting the transcript from it to create further content with, okay? So what we did was you just wanna click on the more button, you wanna come down here and then you'll actually see the transcript and you can see I already pre-copied it there. And then we come over here and we paste it in and now it's gonna go into this canvas type of editor right over here and you can see it's working away and creating the content for us and it's looking like we're probably going to get some really good content. So right now it's in the planning phase. We have keyword research, we have automated campaigns, reporting. You could see where there was some internal link stuff going on. Click rank rating by uh, LearnWire. It's very accurate. Look at a five out of five stars and that's what I actually gave it. So that is really, really cool. So what do we got over here? So it's gonna create a comprehensive blog post for LearnWire based on the click rank review video transcript and then it'll match David's presentation style while optimizing it for SEO and including relevant internal links and external sources. So it has created the comprehensive blog post using H1, H2, and H3s. I say don't use any, don't use H4s or, or beyond. And then I also said, you know, a compelling title, a pricing table, internal links. And I have a spreadsheet that I put uh, uploaded already with uh, internal links before it wasn't, that wasn't working. So we'll see if that actually works. Five-star rating, several external links, a quotation, to end the video and an SEO optimized meta description that's under 51. So 51 characters avoided all AI band words, phrases, and maintained conversational straightforward style throughout. The content highlights click ranks, unique selling points, while giving readers a clear understanding of its features and benefits. Would you like me to make any adjustments? So we can make adjustments, but let's go and see what it actually created for us. So you can see we have a click rank review, very, very optimized, an SEO automation tool that actually works. Welcome back to LearnWire. It's even getting LearnWire correctly, the way I spell it and so forth, really good. Today I'm reviewing click rank and SEO automation tool that promises to boost your rankings without the usual plugins or technical headaches. This sleeper hit on AppSumo deserves your attention. It's one of the most powerful SEO tools I've tested recently. So an extremely good intro. It's short to the point gathers the feel. I mean, this, we're talking, this is a 40 minute video. I'll come back over and show you. This is a 43 minute full blown uh, where, you know, I don't stop talking, right? The way that I edit, edit my videos is that there's never more than a half second where I'm not talking. And that's just for user engagement. When you have seconds that go by when you're, there's a bunch of blanks in your content or silences uh, falls off, right? And so I think that if you've ever noticed in my videos, I don't stop talking. It's because I get rid of any silences um, that I have. And so that's 43 minutes of me talking. It would be thousands and thousands of words of content and information that we just fed Claude. And it was able to wrap all that up and it got a, a general feel in this part right here where I said, this is a sleeper hit on AppSumo that deserves your attention. That was the final kind of feel and the general theme of while I was doing my, my review, because they don't, didn't exclusively partner, you know, they put their deal on AppSumo, but if they don't take the full marketing package with AppSumo, they don't get the, you know, AppSumo doing a video on the product, sending out emails on the product, and they're going to market your uh, product more if you kind of get that marketing package with them. And so click rank did not get that package. And I can tell, and so they're just not getting the attention that they deserve. This was this is a really, really awesome tool. And so it picked up the feel of that right off the bat and it puts that in the in the intro. So super, super cool. Uh, the tool connects to your website through a simple JavaScript snippet. So all this stuff right over here, their website already shows impressive traffic numbers. All this information that's coming in right here is information that I'm providing as the software reviewer. This is information that if we went and just went to, everybody else is doing this, just trying to like create these lifetime deal websites and so forth. They're just going and taking the sales page on AppSumo and they're going and putting it in AI and then saying, write an, a review on this. And you're only gonna get, you know, the results that you're gonna get from that, and if someone actually lands on your page and reads it, it's not gonna be that good. This is from someone that actually dove into the software and really actually researched it for you. So it created a pricing table, which I instructed it to. The pricing is 69, 138, and 207. Uh, let's go over here. So we're at 69, 138, and 207. 
We have 69, 138, and 207. So that is 100% accurate. Websites, one, two, and three, 500. This is 100% accurate table, which is great. Um, and then we can come over here, click rank, demo and features, dashboard and setup. Uh, so the, let's see right over here. This keeps your site, blah, blah, blah. The span style color, green, font height, content, boom. So this right here, it actually is giving us an internal link. If we hover over that, you'll see it down here to the left that it is going to insert this WordPress plugin method often slows sites down, but uh, I'm not sure what this is gonna end up looking like when we actually paste it into our site. So, but this is how it is writing the internal link. So I'm not sure, we'll come back to that. The UX feels professional and well thought out. On-page SEO, Grink's page optimization includes title tag, it keeps going through. So then now we have a list right here. We have tables, internal links going in, schema market right there, internal links right over here. It's adding another one, Link Whisper right there where I did reference that. And we have Link Whisper on the site right over here because you can see down here in the left lower half, left corner. So that's very intelligently selecting an internal link that I that also is very relevant to me talking about internal links, which that's actually really, really cool. Keyword research and tracking, automated campaigns, reporting, ClickBank, Click Rank, final thoughts, delivers exceptional value for individual site owners and small teams. The combination of Google Search Console data with AI-powered optimizations creates a uniquely effective SEO tool. What impressed me the most, the slick responsive interface that makes SEO tasks intuitive, dynamic page up updates uh, through JavaScript rather than direct WordPress editing, comprehensive feature set covering all major SEO needs, data-driven recommendations, keyword tracking, and lightweight implementation. Areas for improvement are minimal. The alt text generator had some bugs during testing, and I'd like better filtering options in the keyword research tool. Uh, rank, a rating by LearnWire was a five stars out of five stars, and it keeps going, and then it says I've been I've been tough on SEO tools lately, but ClickRank delivers in every category. Very, very powerful. When people start, you know, will land on my on my site and they're reading this, they're going to, you're going to build a trust of somewhat where you do review a lot of tools and you're honest in your reviews. And then when you finally do see one and you, and you write statements like this, you can't write statements like this on every single tool, right? It just doesn't make any sense. So that, this is just another powerful kind of personalization and customization of the actual reviewer. And this is why I like this strategy on using Claude combination with an actual real YouTube video that I created. And it creates a very, very engaging first person article for the personal touch on the review. And then it gives this kind of um, quotation. Click rank is a powerhouse SEO tool that manages to simplify complex blah, blah, blah. Okay. So external sources are right here. It is finding Yoast, Moz, support.google webmasters, and there is another one right there. So, and then you have your meta description right here. So it does everything, right? It's doing everything for us. This looks like it's about a thousand words. Let's see what it wrote for us right over here. So I'm gonna go like this. My fancy plugin that I used to have is no longer available. It's not supported anymore. So I do have to go to word counter and paste that in. And we got a 1200 word article. So I wanna do this same thing and see if I can, I'm gonna to subscribe to Google Gemini. That's gonna be $20 a month. And I'm going to see if they have projects and stuff as well. So make sure to tune in, make sure to subscribe to the channel so you can get that content as well. Cause I want to compare and see if we can actually get even better results with using Gemini. I, I believe that it does excel and do a better job at even for, if you want content length and article length, Gemini is going to be the next best friend to Claude as far as writing is concerned. So I want to use Gemini a little bit more because I haven't, I, like I said, I think that it's capable of writing longer if that's what we're, uh, if, 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 if that's what we're, our goal is right but i still am impressed you know this used to be seven or eight hundred words it's now 1200 words so we are heading in the right direction still not hitting that you know i told it to hit 1400 words it didn't but i am pretty happy with this because this type of review you don't really need much more than about 12 to 1500 words no one's going to sit and read a 2000 word review of a software anyways and so i'm pretty happy with this but again i do want to also try some other ones as well so the content length 1200 words pretty satisfied with that 
what we would do here is we would basically take this, we would copy this and paste it in. I'm not gonna do that on video for you guys, but I'm gonna go ahead and create an article and paste that into my site, create a blog post. And then I'm gonna go back in a day or two or when it gets indexed, we're gonna go and optimize it. We're gonna see where it kind of ranks. And then we're gonna optimize it using, right over here, we're gonna use click rank to optimize it and see what we can actually get, okay? So thank you for joining me. Let me know what you think. Were you impressed with Claude Sonnet and this process of taking the YouTube transcript and then creating this unique article? Now, I can already show you this stuff ranks. If I go in here to robot where I keep track of some of these keywords, I can come in here and show you that like, here's Claude and I used Claude with Neuron Writer and we have a 12 ranked 12 spot right there, okay? And then I've used, let's see, these type of articles do work. Here's another one where I've used Claude and every single article that I've written with Claude actually ranks in the, on, on page one or page two right here. And then we'll come back over here. Here was back when Claude three Opus and look, um, one, two, three, four, five, wait, three, four, five. So four out of five actually ranked as well. We had a, a page one ranking right here. And then we'll go and look at one more, which is a chat GBT and Claude combo. All of them ranked on page one, two or three. So this stuff does actually work. And these would have been articles that, like I said, I use my YouTube transcript in order to, to create unique content with the help of AI, which I think is very powerful instead of just plugging in a keyword and letting AI, you know, do everything for you. And you actually didn't do any research at all. Uh, I think that it's more powerful and especially in today's day and age where Google is extremely strict, you, you, you need to have a real brand. You need to have a unique voice. And so I think that this is a powerful way to use AI to your advantage without only relying on AI, if that makes sense. Of course, read through, make sure everything's factual and make sure everything makes makes sense and so forth. And then you can publish it. So make sure to subscribe. Remember, if you want to learn all the secret ways that I use a Claude AI, then you can go pick up the AI Alchemist. It's a low ticket course and you'll really, really enjoy this course. And then also, if you want to subscribe to the LearnWire newsletter, letter, there will be a link below as well. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you in the next video.